There may be fungus in your coffee. That's right, people. The United States government is stepping up efforts to help farmers in Central America to fight a devastating coffee disease, holding down the price of your morning cup of joe. So this issue is caused by a fungus called coffee rust that's already caused over a billion dollars in damages across the Latin American region. It's especially deadly to Arabica coffee, which is the bean that makes up the most high-end specialty coffee. And this is mostly affecting growers who have smaller you know, operations, small farmers, small family-owned projects. And they, built, they make these small batch coffees that taste really good. They're on the higher end of the premium scale. But at the same time, because they're small batches, they don't have the money and the resources available to invest in the pesticides and the other you know, treatments that need to be done to have the spores not contaminate the coffee beans. So this is a big problem. This could cause world coffee prices, especially of the high-end beans, to skyrocket. So the United States is going to be funding some money. It's a $5 million partnership with Texas A&M University's World Coffee Research Center to try to eliminate the fungus. So the reason that this fungus is so bad, it's called Roya in Spanish, and it's highly contagious due to the fact that the spores are airborne. It affects many different varieties, but the Arabica beans are especially susceptible. And also rainy weather worsens the problem, so we could see the global warming and climate change playing a big part in this as well. So this is a big issue. They don't see an end in sight anytime soon. So they're trying to nip this while they still can before it becomes a worldwide epidemic. So if your cup of joe tastes funny next time you try it, you better check to make sure there is not some rust fungus in your coffee. Let us know what you think about this one in the comments below, folks.